Alright, welcome back to game 4 between flight and soccer for Star Wars 6 2011 played on June 12th Chinese time. Uh, I'm guessing that's June 11th is American time or Eastern European, I mean Western European time, whatever. This ma this game, game 4, is going to be played on Twisted Metals, which means the Night Elf is forced to give, has to go for dries and bears. Alright, I'm done. <coughs> God, it's hurting my throat. <coughs> Come see three three games in a row. I'm doing, going for the fourth. Holy God! It's a commentating marathon. God damn it! All right. Uh, <laughs> Fly versus soccer. Soccer is two up up two to one. And on top right, you can see the score. And night elf soccer is going to be the blue night elf at the eight o'clock. Uh, Spy is going to be the red orc. And he's going to go for blade master again. How did I guess? How did I guess? I don't know. Soccer is going to go for demon hunter first. I assume. Yep. And he has the uh, Asian War at the uh, Orange Camp out, outside his base. Which means that Peon's going to see it first right off the bat. And here comes the Blame Master. I expect the Blame Master to come straight here without even creeping. Yeah, the uh, observers pointing out the Asian War, um, Asian War normally goes there. But Soccer built it over, over there away from the normal spot. Fly's going to see anyway. Let's see if he lures a creep. Uh, no? Okay, he's not going to pull the creeps to attack the Asian War. But um, Fly is gonna. I he's gonna have to come straight over here with the Blade Master. And normally on this map, people uh, not people, <laughs> Night Elf players go for Demon Hunter, uh, two three Huntresses, and then uh, transition to Dries and Bears, probably getting uh, Keeper of the Grove second question mark. Uh, I uh, I personally still like Dots on this map, but there's way too many. There's big way too. Uh, look at that big open wide open engagement points the orc raider does go around go around the, the three heroes in the pocket factory of yours and go into the back of the DOS line that's not really uh, what you want that's why I, I'm not go for dries and bears so that's my take on it anyway fly is going to get this tone creeping and looks like in re <laughs> soccer not, hasn't started creeping yet I think he's expected blade master coming here but no Oh, it's a Tomy experience! Oh my god, that's a Tomy experience drop! 15% chance drop and Fly got it! And now, uh, Remind's gonna be completely screwed. And he is going to... Uh, I'm probably getting Creepjack here, let's see it. Uh, Dust! Uh, as you can see, the Blame Master, but still, the Blame Master... Can he get the... Uh, get the Creep, hits level 2, and the item, and the Creep. Oh my god. That, that's so freaking bad for soccer. And soccer in danger of losing the Archer, and the Asian War is getting whacked by the Creeps as well. Alright. Uh, oh man. Big, big advantage for fl for Fly. Hitting every... Everything is working uh, towards his way. And the ground's gonna block. Oh, uh, let's try to juke the Archer. Archer is gonna get... Oh, no! Hidden right before night falls. And I don't know where, oh, the ground's going to go to the lab. Look, look one of the grounds is going to the lab so the flag can reveal the archer. Watch, watch the reveal. Watch, watch, watch it, watch it. Only, there is a, a ground's going to be sacrificed, it looks like. But, oh, no, no, why did you let the archer go? No, bad fly. Now he's going to lose the freaking <laughs> ground to this creep. Uh, let's see if that ground can get out of there. Uh, go, 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 walk, run. No, no, getting snared one more time. Now that ground's going to be killed. Oh, come on. Getting too cocky, I think. Oh, damn! Everything was all working uh, working out for him, but now he's gonna lose the grunt to creeps. Didn't get the archer kill, and uh, turrets start rolling downhill. And Remind's gonna go for fast expand at the nine o'clock. Presumably, I, I, I'm taking. I think he's gonna walk into the ten o'clock. Here's the first huntress. If that gets scouted, that's game. I, I think if that nine o'clock expansion or tree of life gets canceled, I, that's gonna be automatic game. Uh, Flash gonna take this game. I, there's no doubt in my mind. Uh, Remind has <laughs> soccer has to keep that away from the fly as far as long as he can. Three grounds on the ground. Normally, orc go for four grounds, uh, regardless if he lose the one, lose one or not, because he knows he's going to face against dries and bears on this map. Be again, because there's such wide open areas for engagement, and the orc, all the melee units from orc are going to have a such advantage on. Um, on you, especially the old raiders, um, they are so freaking fast, and they can snare all your thoughts and just go right up to your face, and there's nothing you can do. Oh, that third burrow's late. How did that happen? Yeah, <laughs> what? That's interesting. There, food block himself out of a shadow hunter for a few uh, for a few seconds, probably ten more seconds. 
uh, maybe 20 more, but um, uh, uh, hey, <laughs> maybe he spent the money on the extra grunt, or may I think I saw the Blade Master carrying a, a circle of ability and a and boost of speed and a dust, so maybe he blow too much money on those items and didn't get the burr on time. I have some, I'm guessing that's the reason. Here's the Shadow Hunter, very standard versus Dryas and Bears. And if not enough go for dryads and bears on this map without the second base like this, that's going to be uh, autumn, uh, as, as swings the favor towards the orc. Orc is actually uh, the one with, uh, favored <coughs> in this matchup uh, if the night of didn't have a second base. But f uh, f uh, so fly. soccer is going to get a second what? Is it going to a second base really soon up and running? It's a beast master uh, just to f maybe fake out for uh, for a DOS build. But uh, <clears throat> but remind our god damn it soccer already showed the uh, reveal the huntresses so uh, blade master saw there's a hundred saw and there's two lords going down at the same time shadow hunter should be on the way towards the ten o'clock and one lord is going to be cancelled and the blade master is going to try to cancel the second lord that's going to set soccer back even more I think he where his shop where are uh, there we go now oh god soccer is going to uh, get his second base revealed. And there's a couple of ways Fly can do it. Can, he can uh, he can just let that go for a while, and then tr and then uh, just try to get a 60 foot army and just go on head on against Nato army, or he can just tower start towering at the uh, 10 o'clock um, while he uh, after he hits 60 50 foot army that, that is. <clears throat> anyway, the Blade Master is trapped one more time. Oh come on, Blade Master is gonna be killed, but not before before it goes down. I try to kill Wiz, but didn't work. Oh, uh, that's too bad for the Blade Master, but the second base is under siege, and, oh, Serpent Ward, oh, God, Shadow Hunter is going to pick a Serpent Ward first, and he's going to get two Beastery Raiders, oh, man, that second base is going to go down super, super fast, and look at this, all the Serpent Wards are going to be focused down by the Hunters first, and it looks like the, uh, this entire Orc army is going to be cornered, oh, no, don't get surrounded, no, run, <laughs> run, oh, God, yep, there you go, there you go. And uh, normally when pros do it is they will throw a serpent ward on the last second before they get surrounded, so they can they can take a surrounding spot with the serpent ward. Um, but still, you, can, you have to kill that yourself. So it's <clears throat> I, I really don't know how to, how to deal with that. So Flat lost two heroes right off the bat and give soccer a free expansion. And uh, the Huntress is going to have uh, sentinels, and that, that's going to be easy to deal with as long as you attack a tree or dispel those sentinels. And uh, it looks like 100 is going to be sincere and killed. That's interesting. This is when I think Soccer wished he picked the Keeper of the Grove because now these raiders running around without the Blade Master or the Shadow Hunter around, you can just ensnare a raider, surround it, kill it, and then if the, the rest of the raiders are dumb enough to st stick around, you can ensnare another one. But, <clears throat> oh god. Soccer is creeping, but Fly is going to go after that 10 o'clock. Fly cannot afford to have that 10 o'clock harassed or just have it sit there for too long because that's going to give you so many bears as to the to the night elves. The night elves are going to have so many bears. It's, you don't have enough Kodo bees to do it. A nice camera angle by the by the camera guy, by the observer, just to show us how many wisps are ensnared to deny the uh, deny the repairing. Anyway, the rest of Night Elf army are converging towards the 10 o'clock, and it looks like one dry is going to be picked off, I think. He's going to be snared first, and he's going to be picked off. And here comes the Blade Master. What is he doing? What is he doing? Okay, he's going to pop the Street Squirrel just to extract all the army. The rest of the army consists of three grunts and one raider. I think Fly is so far behind. To say that's such a good early game, too. It's a, it's a shame that uh, um, he didn't get that 10 o'clock scout scout off um, but uh, anyway Blade Master is uh, is gonna have to creep to level 3 along with the Shadow Hunter and then he can go well, 50 foot versus 50 foot engagement meanwhile Night Elves has detected tier 3 with bears and with uh, 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 upgrades uh, a lot of people don't uh, underestimate the upgrades oh whoa those two raiders what are they doing the fly forgot about them well, what uh, another raid what what <laughs> Okay, there we go. Fly realized that he should have more army on the ground than than this. But um, if you don't have uh, you don't if you don't have dispelled, yeah, the observer showing us a sentinel. Hey, yeah, we get it. There's a sentinel on a tree. 
uh, there's a couple ways to counter sentinels. One way is to dispel, dispel the tree with the sentinel. You can dispel that uh, sentinel. Along, uh, like, uh, same, similarly, like if you're undead, you just use the destroyer to absorb magic or something, devour magic. You can get that sentinel out of there. But it, you won't have any. Uh, you, the destroyer won't gain any man mana from it though. Um, looks like Blade Master finally hits level two. Shadow Hunter hits level two as well. Shadow Hunter is gonna carry a pen of energy. That's pretty good. Looks like Fire is gonna try to expand at four o'clock. So we're in for a long ass game. Looks like uh, we're gonna be a 80 food versus 80 food fight. That's gonna be fun. Uh, not not fun to micro, but uh, it's more fun to watch. I wonder what the third hero choice would be. Tinker is out of question. Maybe Naga Sea Witch or maybe still Keeper of the Grove still is a viable option as the third hero. Because Fly does not have Dispel. Does not, he does not have any um, casters. And without casters, the bears can roar, they can rejuvenate, and maybe Keeper, Keeper of the Grove later on can, later on can snare your uh, Cold Beasts. So pain in the ass without casters. I really don't know why Fly didn't, hasn't gotten a beastery yet. I mean, not beastery. Uh, Spirit launch. Anyway, Fly is going to go some power creeping. He's going to TP back after, uh, I think he's going to lose the shop. And then Sarkran can just counter TP out I, if he wants to. No, he's going to stay in here and fight, for, fight this thing. Popped up uh, a score, uh, score of the beast. And the uh, did Beastmaster hit level 3? Nah, no, couldn't be. Anyway, um, uh, some mercs have been brought over as well, I think. Soccer is going to try to fly his army low, meanwhile losing some, trading some units back and forth. Also, the Huntresses are going to be useless versus Raiders, so they they can be traded against the Grounds and Raiders as well. And uh, Beastmaster looks like he's going to be, he's going to force the TP out. The Blade Master is potion less than well, he runs out and somehow Fly manages to save the Shadow Hunter because, uh, the, because he forced the TP from the Beastmaster. But now Soccer is going to run away with his economy. I don't know what Fly can do here. Fly try to counter expand and the Sentinel is going to see this peon transferring. That's going to be bad, bad news for Fly. Getting his 4 o'clock completely revealed by one Sentinel. Yeah, we get us, Observer. Stop. Oh, God. But um, Fly really needs to get a Spirit Lounge just to get some Dispel versus those, at least versus those summon units, if nothing else. Um, Naga Sea Witch or uh, Shadow, uh, Dark Ranger maybe is third? Uh, Pit Lord won't surprise me. See, attack the tree with a peon, that's going to get the Sentinel away. That's the right way to counter Sentinel. And here we go, we're going to see another engagement here and the Night Elves are going to continue to put on pressure. Uh, come on video! Uh, why didn't you lag? Why didn't you lag earlier on? Why did you have to lag in the beginning of the battle? Anyway, the Kotal Beast needs to be taken care of right now. The Kotal Beast needs to be babysat by the Orc, and Night Elf needs to focus down on the Kotal Beast. And oh god, that four o'clock wasn't even saturated. All the peons got to return home. I think they saw the they saw the Quill Beast, and they just came straight back. But still, Fly is going to have to fight this thing. He has a shop. That shop is going to play uh, he, towards his advantage a lot. But uh, he's going about to lose the shop. Let's see if he's going to do a last minute, last second shopping with a Blade Master or something. Nope, he's going to lose the shop for the second time. Serpent Wars are going to be on. Oh, God. And Fly has to... Oh, man. That Blade Master has to heal. And the Fly is going to be... Oh, Fly's front door is going to be breached. Fly is going to lose his front door. Oh, God, no! Uh, I, I, I think uh, as we speak, Soccer is, has already transitioned to Bears. Already has Tier 3, has bear upgraded, has Bears upgraded, has Druid of Claws trained, probably sitting in the back of the base. Just uh, next, the next wave is going to be Bears without uh, in, instead of Huntresses. One Raider is going to be picked off right away after it came out of the Beast Jury. It looks like Fly A is going to have to get out of there. All right, yeah, Fly is going to be completely scouted too by the Sentinels. Look at all these Sentinels on the trees, and going to completely reveal the Blade Master mo movement. And now Bl Fly's base is, base is completely breached. Uh, I just, we're, I, we're going to expect a GG here in any second. So Soccer is going to be up to three to one, <coughs> and this is game four, and we're going to see a game five for sure because Fly has won a game. 
Uh, there you go. Yep, Fly is, is one loss away from losing this entire tournament. Soccer is up 3-1. to one. Oh, man. Even by 9 elves. What can I tell you? Can Blizzard uh, balance 9 elf a little more instead of just taking the fair fire lower <laughs> uh, uh, duration? Really? That's the best you can do? Fly GG's. Alright, game 4 kind of... Um, it was going to be one-sided to towards Fly, but Soccer just get the expansion going at the right time, realizing he's ex he's behind, and then got the expansion going at the 10 o'clock, defended with the pretty, uh, defended uh, away from Fly's, uh, any, har any harassment from Fly, and then uh, we're gonna see game five on another different map. See you later.